Today's video is sponsored by Epidemic Sound. So, uh, thanks for to Epidemic Sound. And if you want, you, if you are recording, if you are in video production, uh, if you are doing anything like a, a camera, if you are a cameraman, you just scroll in my description below so that you can be able to use the link in my description. And one to, first, one thousand people to use the link in my description, you will get free one month trial. So, and for today. We are talking about layers and layers. What is more profitable? What can you do? Where can you go? Watch this video up the end. I'm Abraham Tumrani, personal poultry farmer from Uganda. And who is really willing to change the negative narration about your local chicken? So, please subscribe if you are new to this channel. Layers and layers. What is more profitable? What can you choose for? Layers. Layers are the parts which are kept for egg production machine and the layers uh, if you're injecting it is a wrong term invest, yeah, investment but the profit come uh, come back when it's raised to come back they are to bring back the profit but when he brings back the profit uh, they come really in a huge amount and we can take an example like layers but they are more risky Many people choose broilers because broilers are less risky and they are not going to spend a lot of time on your project or on your farm. Layers are going to spend more time on your farm, more than two, more than one and a half years or two years. And uh, layers, because due to a wrong time is going to spend on your farm, it means that you are going to incur a lot of money in medication, management, feeding, or not. But at uh, Despite that, uh, layers can be more profitable than uh, broilers, and broilers can be more profitable than layers, depending on your location and what people are demanding for. Uh, yeah. So, layers, number one, you are going to take a lot of money in vaccination, because you are going to vaccinate the chick from day one up to when you up to when you set the offrea. Because like you are going to uh, follow the vaccination schedule, like around one month, then you do some of the vaccines to give a bit of the anniversary up to the when the, the body will go afraid. Again, uh, on layers, you have to be more sensitive on life security because uh, the moment the disease strikes in your, in your farm, you're going to lose everything. And you remember, the money injected in it is a road cause. First, to get the first production, you have to feed the birds for more than Four months uh, before it gives you it gives you back anything. So you imagine the like the sweat in uh, in around three months before you get in, you get anything and so you have to be more sensitive on layers and then on trailers uh, a bit more sensitive because they are going to spend a short time on your project uh, because they are going to be exposed to all sort of just this week and in those six weeks because uh, you're going to spend less money on vaccination because like the marikas, the breeders are not vaccinated against the marik because you know marik affects the chickens at the, at the age of 12 and at the age of 12. And the bats and the breeders only spend on the farm for the chicken. So they don't collect the marks, you don't collect the vaccination. Uh, and some other vaccines are not going to vaccinate the farm. Then uh, layers, the moment they start production, the way you get the money from one street up to the way the budget go, go grain. But uh, you just wait for the money from broilers on rate when you have sold the bud. And remember, even the layers, they are raining, and after you will be able to sell them. So you have to be able to know where you can go for and where you can choose. The right moment. So rayas are a bit more profitable and uh, than the broilers because uh, someone with a uh, rate of swing that you have 100 bad uh, then you can be able to sell uh, 100 bad. Uh, 100 bad you think it is around three trays. And three trays let us take an example and you are selling a tray at uh, 9,000 or 10,000. You are selling a tray at 10,000 uh, it means that you're getting uh, three trays at Sunday when you 
400 layer by. That means that you're going to be getting the layer by. Yeah, uh, one I mean lay eggs continuously for more than two years. And remember to ensure that someone with 100 the parts in a, to get the same money you like, as you're getting, they say in, in two years or in one year, you have to be able to expose around three or four and the same line. Then we are going to uh, 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 okay, then we can complete it. Players a bit more, 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 a more, expensive than more, because they will be having more, protein content in them, meaning that uh, uh, they will spend a short time on your project, but you will be spending a lot on the feeds. Players, the feeds are more, a bit cheaper, but they eat for a long time because they spend a lot a long, a long time before they can grow. Uh, layer buds, um, in terms of they are a little so sensitive on nature because, like, on the same the housing, when they have the house that you can accommodate like 100 layers, for the case of breeders, in the same house you can be able to keep around 150 broilers. So layers require more space than broilers because when they are naive or when they are spread, they will not produce any anything. Uh, they, they will not play. But when they, for the case of broilers, just stock was I think on one meter squared. For the case of broilers, you can stock up to nine bars. But when, for the layers, only five, four to five bars on a square meter. Then action. Uh, layers will give you more eggs than the players will wait for to the, yeah, the bird. Then, uh, on the case of the market, it will depend on the location because, like in Africa, people are very sensitive and people really want to buy eggs than meat. And maybe nowadays, if you have the layers and you want more money, you want to make a lot of money from the, uh, the from players. You can invest in refrigerators, uh, maybe you order uh, or you get some orders from the processing plants where you make sure that at six weeks you can be able to sell all the bunch to, to the processing plants which will slaughter and then uh, you'll be able to get your either your loss or your profit within a short period and because if you now you have like 100 bucks then you sell uh, like 50, 50 remains of your project. Remember the other 50 are eating the money you sold to the other 50. So at the end you find that he doesn't have any, anything on, on those bags. So you have to be more conscious and depending on your location, you'll be able to see where you can go. So if you're watching this video at the end, please. And if this video has been helpful, please give it thumbs up. And if you're new, subscribe to this channel for more educated videos. See you in the next video. Scroll down and watch more. Bye-bye.